War calls for casualties. No oh! Just... They ask me, bro, why you be snapping like that, like that. I gotta make it, man. I gotta make it rich, yeah. <sighs> All right, so we got another scary game. We got the beast inside. I'm pretty sure this is the full game. Let's just. Go ahead and start it up. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Let's just go standard. Let's go in the middle. This is like the in-between. So we get the puzzles and action elements with the story. So let's just go with the story here. Boom. Click it. Chapter 1. The beginning. Let's go. I'm ready. Um, It's another scary game. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Stay tuned for more scary games. Watch this whole playlist. I promise you, you will enjoy it. I just know. I know it because it's me. It's me. Where? Where am I? Why? God. Why? Adam. Adam! Why are you stalking us? Whoa! What do you want from us? Why are you tormenting our family? No! Adam! Oh, no. No, what have you done to Adam? Oh, God. Adam just got turned to a whole entree meal. War calls for casualties. No. There is no... Oh! We're, just a, we're just a regular family. Do you hear me? We just wanted to live our life. And you ruined everything. Pictures, bugs, threats. And now you're killed. Stay away. Don't. They already know about you. They've been watching the house. They won't let you. Rest in peace. No. What are you doing? It was good knowing you. What are you doing? Oh! One week earlier. See, this, I like games like this where they just come out already gruesomely killing people left and right. This is what we need. Of the past. President Carter had commented on the Russian threat that we And they read for you. What what could get better than this? Huh? Here they go in the woods. I always tell y'all. we go, the more doubts I have. It will be challenging, true. But it was you who kept saying you'd like to get away from the city. Feel the call of the wild. For the weekend, honey. Not for the rest of our lives. <laughs> who says it's for the rest of our lives? Really, Emma? We don't know the day or the hour. Oh, very funny. Like we don't hear enough about nuclear threats in the media. That's what I'm talking about. If I don't break the code, this country would be like a basket full of nuclear mushrooms. Adam, stop it. Stop it. And then again, maybe this shack will fall down on us before Brezhnev's boys launch their first missiles. It's no shack. It's a present from your parents, and you should appreciate it. Take a look. Oh, it looks even better than the photos. I'll tell you about these houses in the woods, well, man. I've made it here before us. And those lazy movers didn't even bother waiting for us. That's okay. We can bring it all in ourselves. Yeah, meaning I toil away when you give orders from the shower. <laughs> Why so cute? What's up, specimen? <sighs> Three hour drive and we're finally here. The place seems peaceful and quiet. Maybe it'll help me to focus on those damn telegrams to decipher. Honey, don't just stand there. Those boxes won't carry themselves in. Why well, I gotta do the heavy lifting? The place seems peaceful and quiet until Emma showed up. <laughs> Alright. Okay, okay. Game's looking smooth. Take the box into the house. Chapter 1. Home sweet home. I actually gotta pull it. Okay, okay. Okay. It's a nice little car. I like my car. I got a nice little car. Close it. Why is it so hard to close the door? 
Gotta get those boxes inside. I should have the box on the table upstairs. The box on the table upstairs, okay. Pick this up, boom. The table upstairs. Please, where's the table? Oh, here we go. Boom. This is where it should be. Time to paint the walls. I think there's some paint in the attic. Time to paint the walls. Reading voice. Simon and Sons Moving Services. Moving date, August 22nd, 1979. Customer name on contact, Adam Stevenson. So I guess that's the guy. Pickup address, Boston, Massachusetts. Oh, this is the first time we're in a, a haunted house where it's not in the South. Okay. Windmill Street 7. We'll, do, we'll charge $670 to move? General overview of work. Transportation of 8 to 10 boxes. 33 pounds each. Plus furniture. Plus some equipment to home improvements renovation. 170. Okay, 170 miles away. Okay, that's understandable. But $670 though. I paid those bastards in advance. So of course they didn't even bother to take those boxes to the attic. You can't trust anyone these days. Okay. Okay, I can pull up my tape recorder with that. Alright. Do I need to take all of the boxes or okay. Look at me. Cause you're the, you a man pick this shit up. Nah, equal opportunity. Girls gotta pick this up too. Girls wanna be so equal. Come help me be equal and pick these boxes up. All of a sudden, we too good to pick boxes up. All of a sudden, that's crazy. Just crazy. If y'all come help me pick this box up. Kitchen. I just could not move into the woods. Like, moving into the woods is just scary. I done seen too many scary movies to do this. Alright, let's keep it moving. I can rotate stuff. Okay, okay. Okay, we'll keep it moving, keep it moving. Boom. Alright, she said we gotta paint. It's Damn, locked. I can't reach it. I need something to pull down the stairs. And luckily, there's a little hook. Okay, 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 okay. Progress, progress. Come here. Ooh, ooh. Get down here. Ooh. Okay, okay. Go ahead and climb on up. You've got to be kidding me. Fuck. Come on. The baby hears everything. He's even in the womb. So we will make a great agent, just like Dad. Honey, I can't get in the goddamn attic without a key. Check the dining room. It should be in a drawer. Check the dining room. It should be in a drawer. In a drawer. As if there was one drawer. Right. Look at me. <laughs> See? Girls get on dude's nerves. Look at this. I'm already annoyed. Hold left mouse button and pull push the mouse. Nope, okay. Nothing in here. See, like, just come out here and help me. Like, wait, wait, why are you on your left? Too good to help. I can't find it in the dining room. Oh, sorry. I, I guess I didn't get it from the trunk. Ah, oh, typical. I uh, see. I'm already annoyed for my character, bro. I'm already annoyed for my character. I should read this too, so that I can be understanding of Emma and her quirks. 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 It's not a nightmare, even if it looks like one. A faking woman's guide to pre Yep, it's annoying. That just sounds like an annoying book already. Let's throw that over there somewhere. It's in the trunk. Who leaves keys in the trunk? What? <laughs> I just thought about what she just said. Girls are annoying. I'm annoyed for my character. I'm sorry, man. Ah, here we go. A key for the door in the attic. Give me that. Let's close this back. Close this back. Boom. Let's keep it mo Do I hear extra footsteps? Let's get up on out of here. Coach, get me out of here. Ah. Go up. Let's go. Whoa. 
Why is there all of a sudden just a gust of wind? Find the paint in the attic. Oh, she's vacuuming. Dancing couple figurine. Rotate to find the hidden message. Oh, oh, is that? No, that's just me. Okay. I wonder who they belong to. Grandma or someone else. Okay. So I just got to keep spinning it around uncontrollably until I figure out the message. All right. Nothing here. Huh? An angel looks like he's sleeping, but he might as well be dead. Poor guy. Life has been rough on him. How long has he laid here? Probably for like a century. Someone must have hit him really hard to make his legs fall off. Wait, is that blood or paint? It's too early. It's too early. Come on now. I don't want to be jump scared. I see a save at the bottom already. What's about to happen? Where is... Where is the paint? Oh, here we go. Damn it. Hmm, what's that? A loose plank. Someone's hidden something under the floor. I need to pry it up. Maybe I can find a crowbar somewhere. A crowbar. How do you drop the paint? My character is clumsy. Can I not just use one of these? Hello? Can I just, can I just not use this? A crowbar. Where is a crowbar at? I got a clumsy character, annoying wife. This is one rough life, bro. This is tough. This is tough. And we just... We just started the game. We just started. So that means there's all types of goofy stuff about to happen in this game. <laughs> what is this? Examine. This one looks unhappy. Don't worry, little buddy. You got wings, so you can always fly away to a nicer place, unlike me. Did the last owner just leave all this? Like, is this what happens when you move into places? They just leave everything behind for you to find? I could have sworn I just seen. Oh, what's the boxes? A crowbar. Whose pictures? We're not even going to question it. We're going to keep moving. A crowbar. Where can I find a crowbar? Could it be in a drawer? Nah, it couldn't be. Couldn't be, right? Couldn't be. Let's go downstairs. I feel like this picture is going to scare me eventually, and I'm not ready for it. I don't want it to scare me. Uh, oh, what is that? Why is there just pipes all over the floor, bro? Like, did they not finish their job? Toolbox? Hello? Can I find a crowbar in this? No? Okay. Uh, crowbar? Hello? Crowbar? No? Oh, this is a big, big house. Mom spent her childhood here, but she never talked about it much. I'm glad she thinks this is where Emma and I should settle down. I can't imagine raising a kid in Boston these days. What's up, gamer? If someone else lived here, why was the key to the to attic in your trunk? You know, we need we got answers. We need we got questions. We need answers to. I don't know. <laughs> Adam, our dearest son. This house belonged to our family for many decades. Some even called it the Stevenson's Refuge. But when me and your dad moved to Boston, we thought Grandpa's just gonna sell it, as he said he would. Well, far without a crowbar. Whoa, calm down, character. You you, you kind of scared me, low key. Well, he didn't. Surprisingly, he left it for us in his will. And now, you and your lovely wife will live here, raise your kids, and simply enjoy life far away from the turmoil of dangerous times. I just know something's going to happen in these woods. And so he just jinxed it right there on that line, right here. 
far away from turmoil or of our dangerous time. Rest in peace to this family already. I can't even imagine a better place to settle down. Take good care of Emma. We'll visit you sometime next month if my aching hip allows that. Oh, it was mom's voice. She she smokes six cigarettes. She had the little hole on her her uh her vo her uh, throat. P.S. Dad thinks he should be the one come up with the name for your son or daughter. I have no idea of why he's insisting on that. Maybe he's just getting old and tries to leave some kind of legacy. Anyway, act surprised when he mentions it to you. I think your character has ADHD. You're reading the letter and he just brings up something about a crowbar. <laughs> right. Like, calm down. I'm over here trying to read. You talking about crowbars. What's up? Thank God I work remotely now. So I don't have to set my alarm for 6 a.m. Rip. 6 a.m. That is terrible. Oh. It's got to be a crowbar here somewhere. Oh, I told y'all. Newports. I told you. Benston? It's the Benstons. Okay. Filtered cigarettes. Full rich tobacco flavored. Made in USA. Bro. Where is a crowbar? This ain't a crowbar, but will it work? <laughs> I don't want to break my fingers. I better check if there's a crowbar in the attic somewhere. If there's a crowbar in the attic somewhere, wow. Wish you would have said that a long time ago. Instead of me coming all the way downstairs, he says it's in the attic somewhere, I think. The fuck is that? A crowbar in the attic somewhere. Don't tell me it's one of these games where I gotta look for stuff. I didn't get that time. Was this here the whole time? The upstairs? Okay. All right. Oh. Oh. We'll leave that in there. I f I'm assuming we got to come back to that. Take. All right. We got the crowbar. Let's go. Open the stash. Where is it? Where is it? It was like right here on this side. All right. Come on. Crowbar. Open up, open. Am I going the right way? Hello? Bitch, I don't have much mouse space to work with here. Come on. <laughs> Come on now. Oh my. Bro. Oh my gosh. I have the weakest character. I have the weakest character ever. There we go. Hope it's not great grandpa's porn mag. Struggled. Yeah. All right. Okay. 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 Is this a Ouija board? Hello, is my game okay? Why is my character doing that? All right, there we go. I have to break the cipher to open the box. I have to break this cipher. All right. So we got a What's this up top? Rotate objects to find hidden messages. 
Find the little eye to reveal the message. Oh, 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 oh. Let me go down there. <laughs> That'd have to be a goddamn code breaker. To... Wait, isn't that what I do for a living? An excerpt from Julius Caesar. Com commentaries on the Gallic War. I remember this from my Latin class. Some letters look different than others. J equals C. Julius Caesar's initials. But why did someone write that they are equal? J equals C. Okay, this is what we like. We like to uh, solve puzzles here. J equals C. I don't think that has anything to do here. Okay. Oh, when the examination mode is on, you can perform additional interactions with objects. Some decoding device. I'm about to get a headache. I already see it. J equals C. So do I need to put C? Where's J? JT? Okay, there we go. We could let's just rotate that over here. J. And then let's look for C. I don't know. Put the J over here. J C. Alright? Is that what that means? No? Too easy? Okay, my bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> my bad, my bad. I thought I cracked the code. I guess not. It wouldn't be that easy, of course. J. J equals C. Okay. Okay. This device will help me decode the letters in the text. It will help me decode the letters in the text. Okay, let's see. Notes. Can I... Can I... J equals C. The letters in the text. How do I put it to it? Okay. Is there a way I can get both up at the same time? Hello? Oh, oh, what's this? Is there another part? Do you see the outlining of it? Or was it already there? Bitch, go back this way, bro. J equals C. What is this? Oh, it looks like the U and the T. Let's see. The U and the T has like the little outline on it too. Okay, well, if y'all have a clue what's going on, let me know, cause, uh... If J equals C, then based on the letter, the first character in the cipher should be... It should be J. The first letter in the cipher should be J. Right? But which way, <laughs> which way is the correct way? J, alright. Do I click on it? Like, what? What do I do, bro? Give me some more clues. I like when you talk. You're giving me clues, bro. <laughs> uh, J equals C. I already put J on top of C. Nothing happened. I can't move this second one. Okay, so where is C? C's right here, right? Okay, J C. Like what 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 else do they want? <laughs> one eternity later. That could be my next one. Cause I remember all those capital letters was there too. It has to be there for a reason. Cause this this isn't it. This isn't working. Some characters in Caesar's letter look different. Okay, so M H P A O M H P A O Okay, let's try that next. 
So M, we got F. H, we got A. P, we got I. It's probably something simple. Probably was. Probably to some other people. <laughs> we don't do puzzles over here. <laughs> T. And then we got O. H. All right. Oh! <laughs> Look, it spells faith. <laughs> ah, we there, boys. We're there. <laughs> Problem solver 101. Let's go. It only took us five minutes. An antique key, but what could you unlock with it? It's the property of Nicholas. It is September 27th in the year of our Lord, 1864. Evening. Is this man reading a, a bedtime story? Please on, please on, please, please on, please on, please. Got my jack jumping on day, jack jumping on day. Yeah, so no dope, but can show you where the zip's at. Bitch, I'm in the whip. Them niggas making plays on the strip. I can't go with it without hearing some lip. Many niggas love this shit. Phone me ringing off the side of my hip. I don't even make a profit off it though. You know it, dealer. Break me up for peace of the gas.